Hello everyone, it's the Upborn team over here, and today we're going to show you guys how to delete specific submission responses from your Jot form. Now, as you can see, we are currently on a Jot form homepage, and while we would typically usually go straight to the Jot form itself, today we're actually going to go to a different page, still related to your form, of course. So, as you might remember, typically when you're trying to edit your form, you're going to want to hit edit form, which will then take you to the home page where you can then start editing whatever features you want to mess around with. In this case, however, we want to look at submissions. So there are two buttons we can look for when we're trying to do that. This is the submissions button right here on the upper left. You can also hit the more menu down here and then go to submissions from here. So once you hit that submissions button, as you can see, it is going to bring you to a sheet of your jot form in this case jot form calls their sheets tables so this is kind of like a spreadsheet table where you can then you typically you'd usually see all of your responses here so let's just answer our form so that we can have our response here and then we can just show you guys how to delete it so as you can see we've just added some responses and as you might notice there is actually a repetition of a response right here now we can actually choose which forms we want to delete, or sorry, which responses we want to delete. And in this case, we just want to delete the repetition. So in order to do that, as you might notice, if you hover your mouse over any of the rows, a square should appear here where you can select a specific response or a specific row of a response. So let's say I want to delete this first one. I'll just select it. And from here, if you head over to the upper right corner, there's a delete button. Hit that button, and as you can see, it'll move it to trash. But what if, let's say, I, I want to get that response back. Now, the great thing about JotForm is that they don't immediately delete your response permanently. In fact, you can actually access any of the responses that you might have thrown in the trash and then take that back in case you did make a mistake in that regard. So how do we access the trash and get back our previously deleted form responses? If you head over to the upper right left corner of your table, as you can see, there are multiple tabs right here, each indicating one page of your table. In this case, we are on the form page that refers to the responses from our job form. Now, beside the form, or at least the form title here, there's a three dot button if you were to hit that. A drop down menu should appear, and if you were to go to the bottom of this menu, there are trashed entries right there. If you click that, as you can see, all of your submissions that you might have deleted are currently here. And from here, you either have the option of permanently deleting it, and as you can see, it'll actually wait 30 days before automatically permanently deleting it, or actually recovering the form. So let's say we want to recover this one. So you can either delete forever or restore. In our case, let's try restoring it. And as you can see, it's brought back to the main form table. And if you want to see what it looks like if you were to permanently delete something, let's just do that. So we'll select this. And we are going to delete this forever. If you do want to delete it, just hit the delete button. Note, you will be permanently losing that data. But hit that delete button and it's gone for good. And that's how you kind of mess around with your submissions, delete and restore if you ever do need to do that. Hopefully this helps you better manage your data collection. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe. And if you need any more help when it comes to job forms, be sure to check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upper right corner of this video or any of the links below. See you next time!